But I'm letting go I'm giving up your ghost It's come to a close Mark the end with this last song I wrote I'm letting go This is the last falsetto I'll ever sing to you my great lost love. This is not a story about happy endings. It's a story about understanding life and love a little bit better. Been there and I've been listening to your complaining and stressed this out. was me towards the end of 2021 where I thought um, I figured things out I figured everything out every single thing of my life when I thought I found my home turns out I'm lost again feels like I've lost hope the happy cheerful me suddenly gone in a flash. I've just been through um, something that is very hard. Kind of saying that I'm no longer have a other house. <laughs> so I thought my happiness will always have an expiration date. It's just a part of life where I begin to understand that it is necessary to hurt a little longer. I need to hug myself a little tighter and stop being hard on myself when things started to fall apart. It's not an easy process, but I let myself go through the pain one day at a time and face it instead of running away from it. Life isn't always picture perfect, they say. And it's true, at least for me. I'm still trying to figure things out. Through the feeling of lost, I learn how to find my way back by focusing on my self-worth. I'm allowing myself to step out of my comfort zone, to step out of the spotlight, and let me be in my most vulnerable state all by myself. I would be lying if I said I still believe in hope because sometimes I feel that this is the path that I was meant to live for. Always in pain, failing in life, in relationships, in everything. And that made me want to protect myself from the outside world. It gets harder to trust. It gets harder to convince myself. But all in all, I'm still reminding myself that this is one of the ways for me to reach the goal that I have been dreaming of since I was at a young age. Every life will have a happy ending. It's just a matter of time and how are we able to control our thoughts and mind to grow and become the best version of ourselves. Eight months into 2022, I would say that it's not all great. I've lost some people, my home, my hope, and my dreams. But through this new healing journey of mine, I'm still learning to accept. And if you are going through the same thing as I do, don't give up because I believe in you. Once you're able to love yourself and get out of the things that are not meant for you, you will be released from that cage of yours and you will be happier. Take a breath. Live your life and let yourself fail. 
because that's how you learn and change into the new and the better version of you. I believe in you and I hope you will have a better year ahead. Sincerely, me.